my absolute highlight is when you instigated the crowd surfing at Norley. So talk me through the week of celebrations. <laughs> yeah, well, we had, obviously it was, so the game finished and we, we were all, you know, in the sheds and everyone was on the drink there and have a good time. And then, you know, it's always cool. Then you go out. I don't know if, you know, a lot of people know, but you, a lot of the sides will go out you know, back out onto the field um, and have a beer later when the, you know, the when the stadium's empty. And it's like such a, I don't know, like just the contrast of, you know, where you've just been, had this massive moment in front of 80,000 people or whatever in this packed stadium. And then, you know, a couple of hours later, or once you shout or whatever, and just go back out and you have a chat, at, you know, and, um, you know, on the middle of the pitch in a, you know, in this empty stadium, like it's, that's pretty cool, you know, and normally blokes get a bit deep and tell everyone how much they love them. You know, it, it becomes, becomes emotional because there's, there's players that obviously are moving on and doing things. So, you know, like anything in footy, you know, there's, you're not always going to be this exact same group of blokes. And, you know, so, so that's always cool. And then we went back to, caught the bus back to, um, the Shire and, you know, the, the field was chockers. It was about, you know, two, three o'clock in the morning and the fans had been waiting the whole time just sitting there and we're doing shoeys up in the grandstand. <laughs> and, and I remember it was Capes and Kate because Capes loved the shoeys. So we were all doing shoeys and there was a picture of me doing a shoey pop up and my missus goes, you know, the most concerning thing is, whose shoe is that? And I said, yeah, that's good. That's not even mine. <laughs> oh. um, then we did that. And then we be like back to league club and all the next day, then we're, you know, hanging around the field and that. And I think everything was getting a bit flat, you know. We just sort of needed a change of atmosphere. And we're like, let's go down to Northies. Like, so they called and sorted Northies out. And I remember getting down there and, uh, Damien Keo goes said to me, he goes, Jimmy, should we get the trophy down here? And I said, bloody oath, damn right. So I got on the phone to Lyle Gorman. And I said, I'm blind. I said, Lyle, you've got half an hour to have this trophy in Norby's. Or there's all sorts. And then we're, we're cruising, cruising around and just hear Norby's erupt and gals walking Gal's walking through with the trophy above his head and the joint's just going absolutely bonkers. And he walked in. We obviously had a roped off section on one end and as he sort of walked down, it was like everyone just like sort of followed, you know, the trophy and, you know, it went from being like chockers like it was already, but it just like sardines and they all sort of come to the edge of our sort of roped off section and then Gal was sit next to me and I I still remember I just remember like 97 and that when Joey like crowd surfed off the bus and shit like that and I've always been like you know and you see like singers and and that crowd surf I was like you know what that would be all time like and I remember sitting there and I was looking at these people and I go gal I'm gonna go I'm gonna go crowd surf on him <laughs> he goes he goes go on so I think like our, our spot you know, from us to them was, I don't know, five metres or whatever roped off. And there was almost like, it was like a chair onto like a table. And then, man, so I was like, I'm going to rail go from the one foot on the chair, next foot on the table, and then whooshka, I'm going into them. And <laughs> so, so that's what I did. I had no shirt. I don't think I had a shirt on. And it's funny, someone actually sent me a photo literally the other day. I, I was talking to someone and someone goes, oh, I think I was doing another podcast with someone and he goes, oh, my friend said, yeah, he actually has these photos. So he sent me through and there's some crack of photos like of me like just floating across like, <laughs> all these dockers and stuff like that. So but it was it was one of, yeah, it was all time. And, you know, it's one of those things like you're, you were king of the Shire for a week, weren't you? Like down there, like it was just, it was awesome. You know, everyone was buzzing. So it, it was cool. 